everyone and welcome back to my channel. In today's video I'm going to be doing a kitchen and family room fall decorate with me. Right now I'm starting off by making a pot simmer. Sometimes I like to do this versus lighting a candle. I just think it smells incredible. I'll link the recipe that I use down below. So starting off in my kitchen, I'm going to start by decorating my peninsula. In this spot in the past, I've done fall tiered trays, but this year I decided to just keep it very simple and use this wood pedestal stand that I picked up from the Hearth and Hand collection last year or so. And to that I'm adding these candlesticks and this gold pumpkin I picked up from Hobby Lobby. Now moving on to this area of my kitchen, I'm going to just add a couple of fall touches. I really like to have the counter space and I don't like my counters over cluttered, so I'm just going to add a couple of fall pieces. Now moving on to probably my favorite part of the kitchen to decorate are these floating shelves. These shelves can be tricky to decorate, however I love trying to figure out what I'm going to do in this space year over year. So I've laid out these few pieces and you'll see later on in the video that I switch out that Julia Child's book for a different fall harvest cookbook. Now moving into my family room, I'm going to start off by laying out everything that I'm going to use in each space in this room. These pumpkins I've had for years, at least 12, maybe even 15 years. I just love them. They're very nostalgic to me at this point, so I just put them out every single year just as a tradition. And to those pumpkins, I'm going to be adding these pieces. Say hello to my dog, Kona. She's a sweetheart. She's helping mommy today. Anyway, I'm going to start by using this Hello Fall sign that I picked up from Joanne Fabrics uh, at least three years ago. I absolutely love it, so I'm going to put it up again this year. I used to think I'm the problem That I was way too sensitive Reacting way too much Until 
I realized we were different types Carrying a different triggers Scaring us to death Oh, someday we will collide Someplace where we can hide our space Forget the world outside Just for a while, some way We will be fine, safe place Just you and I, always I will wait for us to Now moving on to these shelves in my family room, I'm going to just add a couple of ball touches to each shelf. Everything that I use on this shelf is either from Hobby Lobby, Home Goods, or Amazon. Anything that I can find, I will link down below. Well, that's all days now that we see each other. Can we slow down, start over? Come closer. Forget the world outside Just for a while Some way We will be fine Safe place Just you and I Always I will wait for us to Now moving on to the TV stand in my family room. To these pumpkins, I'm going to add this vase that I picked up from Hobby Lobby this year. Inside the vase are florals from a floral that match the garland in my living room. These are still available, I believe, and I'll link them below. To that, I'm adding this gold pumpkin from Hobby Lobby and this candle from Hobby Lobby as well. Now I'm going to decorate my blanket ladder in my family room and to that I'm adding this orangey mustardy colored blanket that I picked up from Home Goods. And on the side you'll see a basket hanging and I got that from Hobby Lobby a couple of years ago and to that I'm adding this plushy type pumpkin that I picked up from Home Goods. Okay, so that's going to do it for my second YouTube video here on my channel. I really hope that you enjoyed watching me decorate my kitchen and my family room. I really hope that you will subscribe and if you could give this video a thumbs up, that would be greatly appreciated. Coming up on my channel is going to be a hallway, entry hall, guest bathroom, guest bedroom decorate with me for fall and following that will be a front porch decorate with me. Thank you so much for your support. See you soon. Bye.